takes effort to stop and to experience something fully like that. My name is Jade Finlinson, and I've worked with the Bell Cervese Panorama since about 2004. It's a nonprofit focused on pre cinematic entertainment and kind of reviving these entertainments that were popular in the 19th century mostly. People would go see panoramas like we see movies today. A lot of these moving panoramas, especially, became so popular, it, it was like a travelogue and um, history lesson and geography lesson of different parts of the world. You come up through the middle into, into a dark space and it's kind of disorienting at first, so you go through a dark hallway and you go up through a spiral staircase, it's very dark, and then all of a sudden you're confronted with a scene and you, it's like you're there. The next big production of the Bell Cervese Panorama, after the Arctic Static Panorama, it's called the Grand Moving Mirror of California, and it's actually um, based on a script that was found in a, in a museum basement in Maine, kind of exhorting people to, to take this journey to California. It was kind of giving people a road map to get there and how to do it and the tools you needed. People would go on tour with these, and it was, I mean, it was popular. It's worthwhile to sit and, and watch and listen and get the full effect of it. It makes you slow down and stop for a moment.